Using an airless sprayer will take time getting used to. If you are new to using airless spray equipment, you may want to continue watching for some basic troubleshooting information. One common issue is that the power switch is on and the sprayer is plugged in, but the pump does not run. It is normal for the sprayer's motor to shut off when the system reaches the appropriate pressure setting. Generally, this means that the pressure control knob is set at a minimum setting. Simply turn the pressure control knob to the right to increase the pressure, and the pump should begin to run, and then will stop when it reaches pressure. Start spraying and the pump should start again. Another common issue is the trigger cannot be squeezed. This generally means that the trigger safety is on and it simply needs to be put into the off or spray position. The pump not priming can also be an issue for new users of airless spray equipment. Generally, one of the following four things has happened. The prime spray valve is at the spray position and it should be at the prime position. Or the inlet screen is clogged with dried paint or debris and needs to be cleaned. Make sure the suction tube is immersed into the paint. Also, the inlet valve check ball may be stuck. Remove the suction tube and place the eraser end of a pencil up into the inlet section to dislodge the ball. This will allow the pump to prime properly. Power flushing can also be effective in dislodging the inlet check ball as well. When spraying, if you experience a sudden stop, it generally means that the tip is clogged. Stop spraying and simply turn the arrow-shaped handle pointing backwards. Aim the gun into a waste pail or scrap cardboard and squeeze the trigger. This will usually unclog the tip. Remember to make sure the arrow is in the spray position before beginning to spray. The pump runs but does not build up pressure in the system. This indicates the pump is not primed or has lost its prime. The inlet screen might be clogged or the suction tube is not immersed in paint. The paint pail may be empty. The inlet valve check ball could be stuck. Again, try nudging it with a pencil. Another possibility is that the suction tube could have an air leak. First try tightening the connection to the unit and if that does not work, check it for holes or kinks. If the pump runs but paint only dribbles or spurts when the gun trigger is squeezed, then perhaps the pressure is set too low, the tip is clogged, the InstaClean filter or manifold filter is clogged, or the gun filter is clogged and restricting flow. Another possibility is that the spray tip is too large, or it's simply too worn and needs to be replaced. If your spray pattern is more round and not as wide and narrow, your spray tip is probably worn and should be replaced. A worn tip will add labor and paint costs to your project. Resolving common airless sprayer difficulties is easy. If you require more detailed troubleshooting, please see your operating instructions.